Number 1. Poplavok Restaurant. Restaurant and Entertainment Complex Poplavok is an opportunity to plunge into a special spiritual atmosphere. When all the complex issues are resolved at the table, and the rivers of beer floats and helps to establish friendships and give birth to new relationships. Number 2. Mindel. The Almonds Restaurant represents a network of institutions with East, Georgian and Uzbek, Tatar cuisine which idea belongs to the owner of restaurant. Appearance of restaurant it is exaggerated East, collected from characteristic features, saturated. It is bright, juicy, fantastically, but thus absolutely pertinently, and it is ideally adjusted to each other. Because it dos nandapos, teeth seem superfluous diversity of fabrics, patterns, flowers though here is enough both that. Number 3. Creme Café. Great location sited very close to the river. Food and service were pretty good by Russian standards although an English menu would help the odd foreign traveler that passes through. Vibrant atmosphere with a mixed crowd all seemingly having a good time in a fashionable setting recommended. Number 4. Chaikana Sholi. The food here is fine, but the service is kind of slow. The music is sometimes nice, but sometimes drowns out all conversation and seems a bit fake, I have a sneaking suspicion they only pretend to play the instruments, and it's all backtracking. The Chaikana in Moscow is much nicer in my opinion. Number 5. Volga Street. Everything started well. Sat on the terrace. Cozy. Embankment view. Music moderately intrusive, inside a separate music and louder. Beer was brought quickly. But the salads were waiting for 40 minutes. The hot ones were generally carried in an hour and only a side dish. And they forgot to cook the fish at all. Salads were not bad, I won't say anything about the main dishes I left without waiting. Baking, tried the muffin, very good. Number 6. IZBA. Building doesn't look good from outside. Typical, old dirty building by the river. Inside, is other story. Done with style, old Russian style, sweet. Good borscht though bit too salty, same with pork. Add garlic with smetana and it become delicious. Bit too oily, but you have to use to it, is Russia. Number 7. Here at Skaya Pristin. Great place for a variety of grilled meat. Limited salad. Wish they would add some big salad options. Liked the rustic look wooden benches. Glass walls, can see the streets on two sides. Clean inside. Friendly service, big smiles. Recorded music with DJ on one night I visited. Not at lunchtime. Cool crowd, all having a good time. Value for money. Order the cranberry or tomato juice if non-drinker. Number 8. San Pizza. Sun Pizza in Astrakhan has been operating for 15 years, while keeping the level, there are enough customers. This already says a lot, there are only a few such centenarians. The kitchen is good, no issues. Prices here have always been slightly above average, but it's worth it. There is a feature of the institution, it has long been chosen for gatherings with children, and the owners are actively developing this niche. That's why. Number 9. Sobrenai. The Belgian Luxembourg trade mission has been hosted by the local Lukoil subsidiary in this high-class restaurant. The ground-level dining room is decorated in an English pub-like manner, the banquet room on the second floor a tad more modern. The food typical lower Volga fare was cooked, presented, and served to perfection. The variety was equally impressive, river pike caviar cooked with just enough onion. Number 10. Beer House. Wonderful atmosphere, staff does a great job of greeting you. Service is very knowledgeable. They also have a menu in English which was very helpful and accommodating. The three and a half weeks my wife and I stayed in Astrakhan, we visited this restaurant least five times and always had the steak salad. Hope you like this video for more videos please subscribe to our channel.